So this is like a, an official vlog. It's not, we're just on my vlog camera. My background is like not even all the way set up. I actually need to go get some new backdrops as well because summer is rolling around and I don't want to do the dark colors. But um, I bought some stuff from Sephora. I got some new nursing stuff and I got some shoes and I just want to kind of share with you guys. Uh, as far as school was just, once school was over, I just, my coping mechanisms, I already told y'all, I don't cope well. So I sleep, I eat, and I shop. And that's basically what I did. So the Sephora VIB sale was was a thing. I'm a Sephora, I'm a Rouge member because I spend a lot of money at Sephora. Um, and then I also ordered some stuff from Amazon. And I guess I will share the medical stuff first um how about that so yeah this is just an amazon order um because i'm actually excited about it and i also have a little amazon thing here but i'm most excited about this and ciao yes so i ordered a litman um i am usually a mdf girl um this is actually the first litman i've ever owned i just like mdf and you guys know that i have the white and rose gold stethoscope but honestly it is so dirty it gets dirty very easy on top of that my hair is red so now all my white tubing is stained pink and i just think it looks very unprofessional in the clinical setting like as far as work I don't care if it's like three different colors like white beige and pink um with some red on it I just don't care because I'm at work but when I'm in like a clinic or I'm rounding with a practitioner it just looks hella unprofessional and I don't like it so I was messing with my friends Litman Jen and she has the big daddy she has like the $500 one that you can hear the cardiology one you can hear everything it sh lets you change the bell it lets you see what your um your heart rate is it's I love it but is Jasmine about to spend that no I'm not so I went with the little daddy not the like baby daddy but like not like the step daddy yeah we're gonna call this the step daddy because not the baby daddy but the daddy but not like big daddy okay so i got the cardiology what is this five um and it is so cute this is actually my first time opening it and obviously you guys saw it so i got the turquoise which it is like hella washed out i'll insert a picture of it i'm also going to share it on instagram so i'll just insert the instagram picture but it is um the turquoise and smoke gray sis this is so freaking nice this one is the bigger tubing it's a little bit heavier oh i'm very excited of course you know it comes with the different ear pieces which most of the time I'm fine with the regular ear pieces, but every once in a while I have to switch them out because I don't know if you guys notice, but I have a really <laughs> tiny ears. So sometimes the ear pieces are too big for me and I have to switch them out. So um, I needed, yeah, I just needed something that was a little bit more professional looking. So I went with that and I figured the turquoise um, would be good with my hair color. <laughs> let's just be honest I was like blue and red it'll be cute so the next thing I got from Amazon is a new bag and this is actually a work for work um and it is simply because my work bag I have broken like all of my zippers <laughs> don't ask me how and then some what well, I know it's how I shove a lot of crap in it and then on top of that um I take a lot of stuff with me to work and then it's just over full and I just be throwing it all over the place it's, it's it's a mess and it's old so it was time to upgrade it so I got this cute little bag it is of course black and it has the gold trimming um, I wish there was an option for black with silver but it wasn't but it is what it is and in the inside it's just white stripes and it opens at the top but it's still 
a backpack because I am a person like for work I like the backpack look so um I got a screen protector for my iPad because unfortunately I still don't have a screen protector on it and as much as crap as I'm talking I'm walking around with no screen protector on my phone and no case on my phone but that's another story um so I still needed a screen protector for my iPad, so I got that, but I did get a screen protector for my phone as well, so now that this has come, came in, um, I'm going to put a screen protector on my phone, and then I just got a new marble case for my iPad as well, because the case that I have on my iPad, I actually do not like it, and the only reason why I got it was because it was at Walmart, and it was like the cutest one out of all the ones they had so it is just marble like you know the regular basic ass marble that every girl in the world has That's everything i got medical wise the biggest thing i was excited about was the stethoscope and um the bag if you guys would like a litman versus mdf stethoscope video please let me know leave it down below i'll put a little i'll pin a a comment and um thumbs it up comment on it let me know if you guys would like to see that and i'll most definitely do that now i'll show you guys the stuff that i got from sephora from the rouge sale or the vib sale whatever um honestly i haven't done makeup in so long so i was like clueless as to what was popping what was old what was new y'all i've been in my own little school world so um the first thing I got was this, it's called Bring Me, it's the hydrating trial kit from Laneige. You guys know I am obsessed with them. So when I seen this um, hydrating kit, it comes with a cleanser, a toner, a water bank essence, and a moisturizer, and a sleeping mask. I was like, yes. So I am going on a trip in about two weeks. Yeah, in about two weeks. And I felt like this will be perfect. They're all travel friendly size. Um, and I can try some new stuff out and see if I like it. I think I already have like three of the big size sleeping sleeping masks or sleeping kits. I don't know. Um, so speaking of Laneige, I also got, let me get closer. <laughs> so I also got these, um, the new lip balms. So I have this huge tub of the sleeping mask. I am probably never going to get through this whole thing because a little bit goes a long way. But I figured this would be good. Keep one of these in my car, one of them in my work bag um, since I have this one in the house. And yeah, I'm excited about these little things because Laneige is doing their thing. I don't know if it's pronounced Laneige, but sis, that's what it is today. <laughs> I also seen Sephora has a new mask and this one is called the freezing mask. Seeing that this is new, I have tons of the Sephora masks and I like them all. So since it was new, I was like, let's try it out. Um, do I have anything else skincare wise? Oh yeah. I have like a lot of skincare samples, but I'm not gonna go through them samples with y'all. Like that's this. That's what we're not gonna do. Um I also like Glow Recipe. I've become a big fan. So I spent this ridiculous amount of money for <laughs> this Pineapple Sea Brightening Serum. Um, it, let's see. Oh yeah, I have their Avocado Mask too. This is not new, but I have been using this one lately. It's been one of my faves. So when I seen this one, I was like, I gotta get it. And since it was 20% off, I was like, I might as well get it while it's on sale because that's crazy ridiculous expensive um and that is it for skincare makeup wise i just got the anastasia riviera riviera rivera no riviera it is this colorful one. Oh gosh if i don't blind y'all so um not that i even do a lot of colors but the fact that they came out with a colorful palette i really wanted it for this like goldish yellow color um and i get most of their palettes anyway so i was like let me just get it i wasn't like oh my god i need it but since it was on there and i it was i had the sale i was like okay i'm gonna get it 
Now this is what I was hyped about. <laughs> Y'all know I love me some Riri and um, she came out with some bronzers and this new kilowatt foil. So I was like, yes, yes, I need this in my life. So this is Penny For You Thoughts. All you thoughts bobbing out there. Um, this is so, oh, it's so freaking pretty. It's like a penny copper color. Um, my camera is not doing it any justice. Um, but for the summertime when I actually get some, some color, yes, honey, we're going to be snatched. Um, I also got the Sun Stalker bronzer in Coco Naughty. This is, which one of these is the dark one? I think this one is not the darker one. Um, but I think this will be a good bronzer color for me. Um, and then I also got the dark one to use as contour. And this one is Mocha Mommy. I also got two of the mini, um setting powders just because like I said I am going on vacation and I think these were like 100 point perks so I was like sure why not I have so many points saved up so I got honey and nutmeg and then I also got another 100 point perk this is a perversion la mascara for traveling so since it was a sale I went ahead and got this blush from NARS that I've been eyeing for forever and it is called Outlaw. It looks a lot pinker on camera than it really is. It's more like a rose, um, like a rose, a mauve with gold flecks. And that's basically all of my blushes. I don't venture out too much when it comes to blush. So I got that. Um, I got another Anastasia Beverly Hills eyebrow pencil brush or eyebrow brush <laughs> and then so artist couture mac zaddy um it came out with these new glosses and this was the only one that i was like okay i can be extra enough to work to you know rock this one and it's called la freak so it is like a rose oh don't focus on me so it's like a mob rose with um like gold and green flecks um so all of them are like very shimmery um but i like that this one is so thick and i feel like perfect for the summertime um uh they're so cute but like i said you have to be extra and for those of you guys who watch mac daddy you know he's extra so you got to be extra to rock these um but like with a basic simple eye some lashes skin glowing in this gloss yes honey everything so I was watching Drea and um oh, Jesus what is her Instagram name most of you guys know who Drea is if you don't I'll put her picture somewhere up here but she is popping all over the gram and her makeup is flawless her hair flawless like she got me wanting some bundles um but she was talking about her favorite nudes and she rocks the best lips like nude lips in the game so she was talking about charlotte tilbury nude kate i've already messed the tip of this up messing with it um so most of you guys know nude kim um that is basically like my skin tone i'm so hyped about it <laughs> everyone always talks about nude kim that is like their favorite that's the one that sold the most and i was just not feeling it i felt like it was too light for me so when she said new Kate, I was like, yes, I need it. So I got it. <laughs> the last two things are just, I got this milk makeup. Um, I don't have too many things from milk, but this is one of their little stamps. Let's see, focus, focus, maybe, maybe not. But anyways, um, for the summer, I thought it would just be super cute to do like a little stars and then I ordered the wrong lip liner um not paying attention but I got the aqua lip and I don't even know what color this is in it says 1c it doesn't even have a name on it it's hella light and I mean I could finesse it don't get me wrong but I just don't even have the energy to send it back um and I guess I'm gonna share with you guys some new shoes that I got because we're just sharing everything. Um, so the first ones that I got 
were these vapor max so you guys know um if you don't know if you don't follow me over on my instagram and my snap i have the pink ones or the rose gold ones whichever you want to call and i love them so i went and got the black ones and next on my list is the gray pair and i low-key want the white and gold ones but these is a whopping 190 so sis i mean i be spending a good coin but sis so i got these love those um and then i got two pair of vans the first pair of vans i got are these i've already wore these um the red and white checkered ones um and i read up on the black pair so i already own a black pair but girl they so run down and tired but i literally wear them all the time so i just got a new pair i haven't even put the straps in these um or the shoe strings in these um but i did need to get a new pair of those um and that is it that is it for all the crap that i've been buying i'm saying that is it like it's not a lot of stuff it's a lot of crap but it was necessary at the time <laughs> um so i'm gonna call it on my shopping for a little bit and yeah <laughs> i needed to get that out you know shopping retail therapy it's a lot of re-ups it's a lot of skin stuff it's a lot of medical nursing necessities so i feel good about all my purchases okay <laughs> So, um, what am I going to do? Oh, so I'm about to go and actually do some homework for my summer class because I've literally done nothing and I've already been in this class for a week. So <laughs> I'm going to go get some stuff done and then I am, we're going to go some see in game tonight. So those are, those are all of my plans for today. So I just finished doing my intro. Um, you know the beginning of every online online class you have to like introduce yourself to the group <laughs> that you're placed into so what do you do what kind of nurse are you um what else did she tell us to do because i just blanked out and i literally just done it y'all my brain is so fried i can't believe i'm in another class already um what do you do where do you currently work I did not tell them where I worked. I was like, bro, I'm a critical care nurse. But I'm not telling you my place of employment. Um, what roles do you play when you're not at work? And what do you like to do in your free time? Sis, what free time? So, I just did that. And now we are going to get ready to... Um, go to the movies first i am going to probably my husband is pulling up now but i am going to probably write down no i'll do that when i get back um i was going to write down all of my assignment due dates in my planner so i'm trying to create an academic planner and it has been so hard to find a vendor or a manufacturer that can do the type of planner that i want um a lot of you guys responded on um instagram that you want one um you want an academic planner so i am still in the works trying to get that done for my summer launch just bear with me okay all right everybody say hi i'm on live we youtube in the back <laughs> so i do my videos on my iPad or like the videos I want to film on my iPad. There was a lot of stuff going on in the background of me recording this video. So in order to not get copyrighted, I'm just going to do a voiceover. Basically, I'm just telling you guys that I use my iPad and I'm writing down some ideas that you guys actually gave me during the Instagram live. I have filmed another clip, but when I went to export it, it said that it was corrupt or something was wrong with it and I cannot recover it. So I'm just going to leave it out. It was just basically me telling you guys that I really enjoyed the live and thank you for all of you guys that came in and asked questions as well as um, some of the video recommendations. There were a lot of recommendations for school related videos that I have already written down for fall. But um, trying to come up with videos to film during the summer has seemed to be very difficult um one of the things i do want to do is actually take some time to 
organize and redecorate my study area. So I'm definitely putting that on the list. And you guys did want a self-care video that you can do at home, like on a budget. So I'm going to do that. And then what else did I say I was going to do? Um, oh, some story times or experience times is what I like to call them. And uh, you guys seem to really enjoy those videos. And of course, you guys know I am going to continue with the vlog. So basically, I just kind of try to write down every video idea that I come up with, whether it's good or it's bad, whether I do it or I don't do it, just jot it down anyways. And that's something that you guys should do if you're ever, whatever you do, whatever you're thinking about, if you just have a really good idea and you're a creator, just always write it down, whether it's good or not. So thank you guys so much for the live and thank you for watching. Don't forget to sub. Love you.